up everybody welcome back to my channel so today we are going to be doing diy lashes with the ardell lash extensions because your girl is tired of looking like a naked mole rat so let's get started all right so i bought this from rite aid this is the ardell obviously diy it was 10.99 so not a bad price considering how much you pay for eyelash extensions i had them for years I had an amazing girl that did them, but then times change. So yeah, so we're gonna do this today. So I'm just gonna cut this open and then we'll get started. Okay, so after I cut it open, oops, don't drop shit. All right, you get an adhesive in the clear and then the remover is, has like a little bit of a green tint to it. So I'll be using, using, oh my goodness. That, you also get some little tweezers with it which is always which is always nice and then you get the eyelashes so yeah and then it has like a little you know picture thing on the back of like what to use and stuff but yeah i'll be using these today and i'm going to go for more of like a cat eye so yeah if you're interested keep on watching First, you do great. <laughs> Additional needs will be a compact to look at yourself and then a spoolie just in case you need to brush everything through. Now, I have kind of like almond shaped kind of, I have almond shaped eyes. So with your eyelash extensions, I don't want to accentuate the bottom part because it's like gonna weigh it down. So I'm gonna bring like the end of my eyelash extensions right here instead of down here because I want my eyes to look open and not like closed even more. So yeah, that's kind of the technique I'm going to be using. So just so you all know. Okay, let's get started. So I'm just going to be putting the adhesive on the back of the paper that it came with. So I just put a dab, it's clear, that was a stupid question. Okay, it's over there, it's just like a little bit of it. As I was saying before I got cut up, just put your glue on your pad. Mine's a little tacky now. Perfect, we're ready to start. <clears throat> All right, so to begin. So I'm gonna actually start with the medium ones and then kind of work my way back when I need to. Okay, we'll start with this eye first. So I'm just gonna be taking my tweezer, going in with the medium. So just dipped it in. I'm going to be looking down. Just placing it down, do you see it right there? The adhesive, you can feel it a little bit, so just be careful with how much you apply to your actual eyelash. So again, I'm just taking that, I'm dipping it in a little bit just at the tip. And I'm gonna switch, grab my compact. Here we go, it's little by little. And then again, so if you can see that, it's literally that small, little bit of glue. And you wanna keep your lids like half open like that, even less. Alright, now I'm using the long one and I'm gonna go right and almost stack it on the other one that I put earlier. And 
I'm just going again with medium ones now and I'm just kind of stacking them on the outside. I'm gonna start layering them up even more. So I'm just gonna keep going on top with medium and large ones, adding the large right here, so the outer like one fourth of my eye, and then I'll do the medium more here because I wanna create a solid black line uh, to make your eyelashes look thicker. So that's the game plan. All right, here we go, so more medium. You can take the back, oh my God, how funny. You can take the back of your tweezers too and just kind of press them in. Okay, another long one. I'm gonna add some in the front now, actually, too. Didn't think I was going to, but I am. The front ones are a little bit harder to do because one, I'm trying to do it recorded, and two, I don't have that many lashes right there. Never mind, I had to do the front one off into this mirror. Okay, so, mid check. You can see just the outside, and I'm gonna keep going in more. I would say another trick, pick up the eyelash at the angle you want it so you can adjust your hand to where, like, the eye, like if you pick it up and it's crooked and you put it on, it's gonna be crooked. So just make sure you place it at the angle you want. So. All right, so I did the other eye off camera. And yes, this is the results for a pack for $10.99. It's supposed to last two weeks, so we'll see how that how they do. But yeah, this is the pack when I'm done. So I use a lot, almost all the longs, a lot of the mediums, couple smalls. But yeah, the glue was super easy to use and it was pretty easy to apply. You're just gonna apply them like the single lash extensions you would use like for one night but these just have a different adhesive so they're able to stay longer. So yeah, that is what we're working with. The Quarantine DIY Lash Extensions. Thanks for coming to my video and I'll see you in the next one.